Okay. You see how the shingles cascade down? Because the water can run from shingle to shingle to shingle. Underneath these shingles is an underlayment. And the underlayment also, like these shingles, is installed so that one piece cascades down over the other piece. It comes all the way to the end underneath here. And I can't get up in here because it's been glued down, which is a good thing. And it's kind of boogered up like that when I got here, honestly. But so I went ahead and went a little farther. But what I'm here to talk about is this drip edge flashing. This drip edge flashing right here is supposed to cascade down over the edge of this, over that bead right there. <clears throat> so any water that gets behind the shingles and goes down the underlayment and gets down to the drip edge, it'll curl and go between the drip edge and the fascia board. Oh, that's a cement board fascia, bud. That's not, no. Let's tell you how it's supposed to go. I'll tell you how it's supposed to go. That's, I didn't make those rules up. Now in the garage, you're going to see, as <clears throat> you saw in the attic, in the attic video, we had a leak in the garage right about there. Look at that. See that really good? That's probably where your leak's coming from. I'm not a rocket scientist about this stuff, but that looks pretty messed up to me. The way this comes down, to it gets to this point, it's called a dead valley right in there. That's a problematic area. Alright? Now, we don't want a boring house, so there's that okay we don't want a boring house so we're going to have different shapes and things but as it comes down there we just need to know that all the water coming off of this all the water coming off of this they all hit at this one point point. and see the way they got uh, they've added they've extended see where they've added onto this they've been wrestling with this point they've been wrestling with this point and any all the sealant this all that pooky around there Okay, it needs to be checked every year or so because it shrinks, it dries, it pulls away from the brickwork. So this is a, a heavy maintenance area. What am I looking at here? Let me come on down. Let's see if I can get another angle. I'll tell you what I was going to do is I was just going to like walk over there. I mean, I'm still walking. We're just going to carry the ladder over here. Look at this detail just a little more. We're going to get a bonus round. You think they've been trying to work on that? I do. You think that's going to take some ongoing monitoring and maintenance? I, I think that too.